Bucks have lost the first of the two-game weekend series all season. They are 0-6, but they look to go 6-0 and in game number two, and Hunter Harris would get things going early inside the Edmond Center. He gets the first bucket, gives the Bucks just one of two leads on the day. Jarvis Jones, the jumper from the head of the key, he knocks down the three. But the Bucs defensively early on giving up a lot of shots from the outside coming off the bench. Tanner Plemons, he would knock down the three. Eight of 16 from three with Stetson in the first half. Hunter Harris, his first career double-double. Harris would finish with 12 points, 10 rebounds, four offensive. Jarvis Jones, the redshirt senior, continues to play well. He hits the baseline jumper. Lester Wilson, he'll fire the three from the corner. Coming off the bench today, the, the redshirt freshman, but he knocks down that tray. But again, in the corner, Adam Pegg, this time he was able to get a two-point jumper from the baseline. ETSU able to move the basketball, and Lester Wilson elevates up and flushes home after the assist from Petey McLean. Speaking of McLean, skip pass to end the first half for Sean Rimberton. Boy, in and a half of the three could be a common theme here. Right side, Rimbert this time a pump fake as we pick up action in the second half. Bucks already down 20. That's just the way they like it. Cutting through the lane, John Walton from a nice feed from Hunter Harris. He slams it home. And then the defensive play by the big fella, Kennard Gatston Gilliard, lumbers down the court, takes the foul. He finishes the three point play. Then Jarvis Jones after a steal, he'll drive left side and he'll kiss it home with the left hand. This time he drives down the lane avoids green and lays it up on the left wing with the basketball on the left side Rashawn Rembert he would hit four threes and he hits it from the left side Bucks battling to try to get it inside of six all of a sudden Stetson gets it back to nine Hunter Harris makes it seven John Walton with a steal drives down the lane he would finish the free throw to make it a four-point game. Then Kennard Gatston Gilliard with the steal, the skip pass to Rembert. All of a sudden, it's a one-point game. Stetson, though, comes down the lane. Hunter Harris, watch this crazy sequence. He gets a block. Now the Bucks thinking they can have their first lead since two to nothing. Rembert, a good look right wing. He can't hit it. Hunter Harris with an offensive rebound. Harrison decides to shoot the basketball from outside. He misses it. It's scramble for the basketball, and all of a sudden, here comes Stetson. Joel Narberg's with the basketball, and Aaron Graham had a huge game in the corner for three, makes it a four-point game. Bucks trying to hang in there. Jarvis Jones feeds inside Hunter Harris. He'll drop step baseline. He'll bank it home, and all of a sudden, Bucks down two after a traveling call with 19 seconds. Bucks get it to the corner. Rashawn Rimbert with 5.8, nails the three. Stetson, one last chance. KGG tries to step in, a lot of body contact. John Walton eventually comes up with the basketball. ETSU ends up winning 62 61 in a wild, crazy finish to this contest. Bucks points in a paint 30 to 14.